And we're live. Hi, it's Aussie Brick Chick and Aussie Brick Glow. And welcome to our couch where we uh, crack into our Lego pile of shame and build something every Tuesday night. Oh, better turn the volume down on that. Uh, every Tuesday night uh, is our time to hang out with each other and build and uh, hang out with our friends. Speaking mm. of friends, we've got Dark Side Bricks. What are you building? <laughs> Oh my god, who is this guy? You're not dark side. I'm his younger twin brother. Or oh. his older twin brother, depending on who you're talking to. <laughs> what you building? Uh, I'm gonna be finishing my um oh, wrong camera. That's it. <laughs> that I thing. Missed, I missed having both cameras running set up at the same time. Um uh, uh, yeah. a Star Wars set. My last, re my last to be rebuilt Star Wars set. Oh. After that, wow. I don't know what I'm going to do for stream. Crazy. Okay. Well, we also got Dan, the man from New Zealand from between the bricks. Hello, hello. You're looking very red today. Uh, I am, yeah. <laughs> Bad Make color sure. choice of T-shirt. Make like, sure you wave, wave the background red. red. Uh, I'm, I'm going to be building, uh, I'm going to finish building this set that I started over on my stream. Nice. Lovely fingernails too. Did you lose a bet? <laughs> no, it's a long story. He gained uh, let's just say that my supporters over on my stream paid for me to paint my fingernails to uh, fundraise for me to buy a stream deck. Oh, I met the goal and we all ordered it online together. Cool. Oh, that's lovely. Right, I'm feeling pretty, pretty lucky, pretty blessed to have such a great community around us. Lego community can't bloom and beat them, can you? Yeah, they're awesome. I don't know what it is about the lighting tonight. I don't know. Maybe this isn't as close as it is. Probably not. A bit better. That's a bit better. It's feeling a little bit dark. Oh. Okay, let's have a look and see who's joined us in the live chat. We've got Harrison. Hi, Harry. How are you? We've got Andrew Thornton, Martin M. I'm guessing that means that Tass is around too. So, welcome. We are finishing the Mustang. That thing. Yeah, that thing, that thing, that thing. <laughs> now I know why certain YouTubers... Um wear sunglasses and stuff while they're doing their things because they can actually look off the reflection and point to things quite quickly. Ah. That's why Casey, yeah, Casey Neistat does it. Ah. Actually clever. One of the reasons why. Pretty sure that's how one of my high school teachers used to, like, not look at people but sort of go like this and go, you boy! That one from the front High school teacher was cross-eyed who could actually go like that. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, we got Warren G's joining us in the chat too. And, oh, Dan. What? Dan being Dan. Dan, 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 Dan. Are we going to finish this tonight? Yeah, it's only <laughs> three bags left. You, you sure about that? Yes. <laughs> What bag are you up to? Oh, Four. we're halfway through. Four out of six. We're halfway through. How did you enjoy the first half of the build? It was good. Took a while the, to get somewhere. Cars are always fun to build. Took a while to get somewhere, though. All that building the bottom of the chassis feels like I, I have not had the pleasure yet. Oh, I know. Oh, really oh thanks. <laughs> I was disassembling some dinosaur park base plates and I was wondering where this got to. It just sort of flung off into the distance. It w went into the Mustang, picked it up and he's like, piñata. Oh, Jason Carpenter's in the chat. Hello. If I open all the bags, you probably should. Yeah, 
Considering an eight pots out of them. And lots of dark blue. Yeah. Ah, Harry says, my dad says hi, even though he's cleaning up. <laughs> it's like, hi, Stephen. That's a lot of little bits. Yeah. The other downside to these creator cards, you keep putting parts and parts on, your pile doesn't seem to disappear. And it doesn't seem to be very much on the car either. The pieces just sort of disappear for a long mm. while, and then all of a sudden you're like, oh, my God, there's something there's that car. almost looks like a car. <clears throat> Hilarious. Well, I've had a busy day today. I've barely seen him today because I've barely seen you today. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a segue into a story. What have you been uh, doing? I've I've been... I've been working hard, not hardly working, uh, so that I can save up for my brick pension. Nice. So I've been mowing today. And some of the mowing involved going up hills like this. Uh, mowing lawns is not an easy job. No, it isn't. Not even when you have a self-propelling mow mower. It's hard work. A self-propelling mower? I did 7.4 kilometres of walking and uh, nine stories of inclination. It's pretty good going. Let's just say I smashed my, um, my, my goal that I have for my daily. So not only are you uh, saving for Brickvention and earning money for that, you're also getting fit too at the same time. Yeah, I can tell you that the hills that were like this were kind of killer, though. <laughs> you are staying active. Yes, I am staying active. I'm getting out, getting sunshine, getting exercise, mm -hmm. all the good stuff. You're doing more than I am, that's for sure. Uh, you know, it, it would be good if it was more often. It seems to only be like once a week, but, you know, every little bit counts. Uh, mm -hmm. Harry says, nice flash shirt. Cool. Thank you. Yeah, Kmart has them. Um, this one's a, a mall print, um, but the Kmart has the plain red ones, which are, I, I believe, much nicer looking at the moment. This was a Kmart one. Yeah, that's last year's Kmart flash shirt. And I am wearing my... Um, my, uh, what was it, a mashup of, of Owen from Jurassic World and uh, Emmett. Emmett. And Darkseid is wearing a, a very nice T-shirt. I wonder white. who's on the T-shirt. Black and white Star Wars T-shirt. <laughs> And what shirt are you wearing, Dan? While we're on the one that matches his nail polish. <laughs> I know it's red, but what's on it? Uh, Lug South. It's the ah. Lego, nice. Lego user group from Southland uh, that I got at uh, the Invercargill Brick Show, which I went to last month. I think it was. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. It's amazing how quickly your Lego show t-shirt stack grows when you go to a few shows. Do you guys, when you go to shows, mm. they provide a t-shirt at every single show or no, not, at the, not at our, not at our regular shows like that we attend for my log. They provide us with bricks for our brick badges. Yeah. Show bricks, but no, we don't get provided t shirts. Unfortunately, I don't always manage to um properly apply for shows that my Lego sometimes ends up at. Mm -hmm. So I, I don't have shirts from every show that I've been like at, if you know what I mean. My stuff. Yeah. Is but I do have 
I have one from Brick Mansion. I have one from um, the Adelaide. Um, what was it called? Brick, oh, Brick Adelaide. Adelaide. I have one from. I think that's it. I don't think Bendigo Bricks has one. No, they don't have a shirt. But that they're rel they're still relatively small in the grand scheme of things. Um, if I'd been organised and realised that my stock was going to Sydney, I could have gone to Sydney Brick Show one. Yeah. Had I known the colour that she was pink, I would have been organised and like said, "Hey, I want to send something down. Give me a shirt." <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I love I love show shirts. They're cool. Mm. Never have too many tees. Oh, wonder what wonder what Brickvention twenty twenty will be. What color that will? I wonder if it'll be pink. God no. Could be pink. I don't want a pink shirt. I want a pink. Yeah, but if you get a pink shirt and I get a pink shirt, then that means I get two pink shirts. I get no shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny though. Mm, I'm seriously, seriously considering coming to BV next year. Don't consider. Just do it. Oh, there's a few things that need to fall into place first. I know, but, but you know, uh, I'll, I'll be I'll be that little angel or, or devil on your shoulder, whichever you want it to be. I'll just go, do it, do it. You know you want to. <clears throat> oh, I know, I know, I want to. I don't even need to have the little devil on my shoulders for that. <laughs> so I'll just have to make some choices, probably, as to what I'm going to do next year. Hmm. Does it clash with anything? Uh, no, because it's um, Brickvention is actually a good time of the year because it's so early. Yeah. Uh, but it, it just, you know, it comes down to finances and yes, yeah, and the, the saving, 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 saving. Yeah. Well, there's lots that of saving. Lots and lots of saving. Lots and lots of saving. Still going. Uh, probably cost you just as much in airfares as it would be for us. Yeah, I, I actually I have a reasonable amount of um, air points stashed away, but I'm looking at trying to keep those to potentially go. Uh, I'd, I'd really like, if possible, to be able to go to the RLFM days. Um, mm. but, but that's not a given. So yeah, it's a tough one because I could save them for that, but and then, then not make it because that's not a given. That would suck. Or go to BV and or we'll miss out on BV because uh, I save them. I don't know. So I just I just need to do some thinking. Yeah. Thinking and planning. Planning and thinking. Yes, well. Yeah. I have plans in motion. When I have more ideas of of whether they're actually going to come in true, I will share. Yeah. I have I has ideas. I has a plan. I has a plan. Yes. It is a devious plan, but the best kind of devious. It's the sound of concentration. Kind of funny. I need the concentration is real. The concentration is real. Like it's so hard to find all the parts. Okay, so those of you who are in the live chat, what are you guys doing tonight? Are you building something? Um, are you sorting? some lego or are you just hanging out because we love the company but i'd love to know what you're up to and also if you've got any questions that you'd like to throw my way feel free uh, i can give you one little tidbit of information but not much in the scheme of things Ooh, and it's 
to be honest, it's probably not going to be a surprise, but uh, there is a press release mm -hmm. that will be due for release. Let me check for you. I'll check when it's due for release. I can't tell you what it is yet, but I can tell you <laughs> when to look forward to it. Uh, where is that press release? Yeah, keeping us in suspenders, Dan. I oh, know, right? And and the worst part is, the worst part is, is you have to work out what the time is that it actually going to be released for Australia and New Zealand, and that's a bit I don't know. But it's due for release on Thursday the thirtieth at uh, nine a.m. EDT, which is uh, infield time, I think. Mm -hmm. or 1400 two o'clock in uh, british standard time which is london so that would make it 2 a.m thursday for us i think oh no probably 2 a.m friday actually for us good for uh, be four o'clock in the morning yeah because oh, what are we 10 or 12 hours behind well well we're 10, we're 10 oh hours. yeah we're, and we're 12 so it would be 2 a.m for That's us good, wouldn't it? You. I keep forgetting you're across the, the puddle. Yeah. <clears throat> but I, I don't think it's going to be anything super surprising. We've all seen what's been flashed around recently, I suppose. Yeah, I think I did see a bit of a, a teaser. Or oh, and that's the thing, isn't it? Lego have actually been teasing themselves. I'm oh, picking... Oh, oh, okay. I think that's what it is. Yeah, I've, I've seen Lego put up a, a teaser photo last week, I think it was. It was a picture of a minifig on the moon. Yeah, and I'm not actually holding out on you. I don't. I won't get the press release until tomorrow morning. So what's interesting is the tier two RLFMs get the press release. They got it about three days ago, oh, yeah. three or four days ago. And then the tier one RLFMs get it. Well, I'll get it tomorrow morning. And then it gets released on whenever that gets released, Thursday or Friday for us. So it's like a teaser for us too, because uh, we know it's gone out, <laughs> mm. but we don't have the uh, tier 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 ones. Don't get the the really early. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. Some of the, um, the some of the ambassadors will probably get the get that communication as well. <laughs> I have to say hello, Henry. Henry's quickly said a hi bye in the chat. Who comes first? Um, Jason says he's building the Excelsior. Oh, that, that set looks awesome. Yes. Because it's Warren huge. is attempting to build a police station that fits within his city. Nice. <clears throat> And Henry also said, fresh cut, dark side. Oh, I don't know about how fresh, but yeah. <laughs> it was fresh this morning, was it? Yeah, it was actually. Well, I suppose it's new for Henry. It was new for us too. Well, new for me. I've never seen. Oh. I've never seen Dark Side beardless. Neither I was just I. like, who? Who are you? I mean, I don't. I don't think it's a bad thing. It's just different. Hey, Dark Side. You know how you were humming and hiring about this this little cool. model. Was this the one you were humming and hiring about, whether you'd get it or not? No. Oh. Well, maybe. I don't know. Is it, is that right in the existence, Cardo? I'd rate it. It's pretty nice. Yeah. 
If it's from the resistance cartoon, I'll probably end up grabbing one. I don't know what it's from, man. I'm not that big of a Star Wars fan. <laughs> Give it a bit of swoosh. I don't know what that is. Uh, advertised in the back of the book is uh, that same one, that the red and black one. Yeah. So it's a resistance one. But it, there's Kylo Ren and stuff is in that as well, and Poe. But that's all, uh, yeah, that's all just different storyline, isn't it? See, I don't know enough about Star Wars. No, it's a resistance one. I'm going to have to grab it now. <laughs> I think you might enjoy the build. I enjoyed the build. It's pretty cool. It's lots of nice little um, tiles and uh, the way the tiles and the plates come together are actually really nice. It's got some of those new triangle pl uh, tiles on it as well. Oh. Oh, and some, and some light bluish grey roller skates. Everybody loves those, right? I'll definitely have to look it up then. Quite like it. It's quite nice. Well, that's that done. Now what? <laughs> yeah. I have to say hello, Mickey Three CS. Thanks for joining us. So now, what's what's up with our um, feed tonight? We're blurry. Blurry. Mm, just a little. Blurry, see? Blurry. Blurry, blurry, blurry. No idea. A lot clearer on that than we are on there. That's the best pilot helmet ever. <laughs> I keep seeing your polished fingers. They're so beautiful. <laughs> Thanks. What colors are they? Uh, they're all different, actually, all 10 of them. Oh, oh every color is a different color. Oh, obviously, every color is a different color. Oh, everything is a different um, color. I have rose <laughs> red, green, blue, normal red. Purple, uh, like a metallic pink. I don't know what that is. It's a cross between brown and dark, dark red. Oh, another pink, orange, and another purple. Yes, yes. That's right. My fingernails are painted for the first time ever in my life. Oh, my God. Painting, or did you um, work someone else into it? Uh, my daughter did it, and she loved every minute of it. <laughs> oh, that she did. She did it with absolutely no problem whatsoever. No hesitation? None. Not even the slightest. Not even a, Dad, are you, you doing something stupid? Do you really want to do this? It was like, yeah, I'll do that. Rolls into yeah. my Lego room with a dozen bottles of Bloomin' <clears throat> nail polish. Like, I can facilitate this stupidity. That's exactly what happened, in all honesty. <laughs> that was the right. Whose mm -hmm. it's an Apple's collection did you raid? It was my daughter's. Apparently she has, a, uh, you know, a dozen bottles. And here I am trying to get through telling people on my stream, uh, I'd have, you know, if you want me to paint my nails and pay for it, then I'm going to have to go and buy a nail polish because no one around here wears makeup. My wife doesn't do makeup. And then my daughter and I jokingly said, oh, do you have any nail polish? She goes, yeah. I said, how many have you got? She goes, oh, heaps. Oh, damn it. <laughs> and everybody could hear. So that was it. That was the start of the frenzy. You were done. Pretty much. Pretty much. The donations rolled on in and the nails got painted live on the stream. It was pretty much the end of my career. <laughs> <laughs> or certainly the end of my credibility or anything that I had, that's for sure. It's just fingernail polish. Down the toilet. Oh, yeah, no, but that wasn't really just fingernail polish. <laughs> it was also a Snapchat filter with female 
and finger and fingernail oh, polish. Oh, that that built. Oh, I'm gonna have to go back and watch that. And it may or may not have got shared across pretty much every single platform because of I don't know somebody called Philip someone I don't know I haven't seen the name before but I'm gonna look him up. The guy sounds like a dead set freaking legend if you ask me. I don't know, mate. I don't know. He sounds he sounds like a dead set blooming, I don't know, sort of person you want to avoid, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh dear. Here's the nails. Look, just 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 in case you didn't see them on my own stream, look at the pretty nails. Oh, wrong one. Oh my god. If you ask really nicely, if we get I don't know, five people in the chat to say, show us the Snapchat. I will show you the Snapchat. You will be permanently scarred for the rest of your life. I'm warning you now. It's just a female version of me, which I have to say actually looks much, much better. I would look pretty as a female, I think. Certainly, <laughs> certainly with a Snapchat filter anyway. Oh, yes. I think I've heard about this filter. It's like a gender swap one. Yeah, that's exactly it. Do, 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 do. What did you say, honey? Um, so this this app, how do you get it? Or is it just in Snapchat? Just in Snapchat. Oh, fudging Snapchat. Deleted that off my phone. Darn it. Five people. I need five people to say snow up. Show us the Snapchat. We got one, two. Martin doesn't count, mate. You got to type. Show us the Snapchat. Dun, 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 dun. Show us the Snapchat. Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh, man. What am I doing? Well, that's, th that's three. We need five. Uh, I'm really going to have to go away and assess my life choices. Martin, saying it twice doesn't count. <laughs> Jason says, so us is not. We need one more, one more. If I had the chat open, I'd say it. I didn't tell you my psyche, I'd say it. Mm. But I've seen it. That moment where you're like, what's my Snapchat ah, password? God. I have no idea. Uh, Warren G says, show us the Snapchat. I think that's five. Oh, six if you count Dasha. Tassa. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Just before we show you the Snapchat, I am not taking any responsibility for any ongoing lasting mental effects of what this has on you. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not paying for anybody's therapy or, uh, or um, desensitization. Ready? If you uh, don't want to look, avert your eyes now. Ugh, what the heck? Where's my web window? Oh, wrong window in there. Wrong window. <laughs> wrong window. Actually, he's not bad looking. I know, right? I know. I think I'm pretty good looking too. What am I doing with my life? Oh, dear. Dear, dear, dear. What the heck am I doing? Is that enough of the Snapchat? That's enough of the Snapchat. <laughs> <sighs> Serious. Seriously need to reconsider my life choices. Yes. Uh, it was fun. It was fun. And my daughter, my daughter just totally, totally lapped it up, man. No hesitation. Let me get a Snapchat of you, Dad. It'll be funny. 
It'll be funny. <laughs> Get in. Ah, I don't know if that's something to do with it. <clears throat> God, this is so much like I fit. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Right. Not everyone's having an awkward silence. Oh, for love, God. Oh, your password is the same as your previous password. Oh, my God. And it likes to make it easy. I think it was a case of I got my um, username wrong, not my password. <laughs> Harry says, well, that was weird. <laughs> uh, are you talking about the silence or the Snapchat? I think it's Snapchat. More than likely. On a different note, this Mustang's coming out pretty cool. Doing lots of um, snot building here. For the back of it. Oh, for God's sake. What is its problem? I don't know. That's why I don't solve social media thingies. Just Facebook, sort of. Uh, <clears throat> make sure I can spell. Mm -hmm. It's generally a good start. Doesn't look in this time, that's it. I give up. <coughs> hmm, here it goes. Hey, we've updated privacy things. Yeah, okay, that's nice. <clears throat> ah, I saw that message, Harrison. Get him on. Get him on. Oh, my the Lord. Hell? That was me as a penguin. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's funny. Clicked on something I shouldn't have. Um, how do I thingy? How do you thingy? You thingy. I don't know. Well, that's how you thingy, you thingy. Yeah. You do the thingy to the thingy. Um, uh. Um, uh. Hello. Hello. Steve O. G'day, guys. How are we? What's up? Trying to figure out how to find this stupid Snapchat filter thing. Ah, for someone who, who is technically illiterate, I am useless at Snapchat. Oh, is it that? No. That? No. I think it's something to build. No. Ah. Oh, it's set to build. Well, there's no point because it works. 
Hey Harrison, welcome to the Streamers Club. What would it cost you to get your nails painted? Just asking. Um, <laughs> don't know. Hmm. Not sure how many colours we'll have. Only the one well, lady in the house. Can tell you how many I had. It was eleven. Well, I did see they look very pretty. Mm hmm. Would you sell them out for five bucks a finger, man? You're asking me or Harry? Either or. I don't know. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> good on you, mate. You'll make a good streamer. I'm thinking 50 bucks to paint my son's nails. What commission does he get? <laughs> well, you get half of it, Dad. Oh, 50%. Do I? Okay. Oh, no. Screw that. Hey. <laughs> uh, there we go. Even better. Uh, Amanda Fawcett. Thank you. I got this one only for the stickers, but I'm going to build it anyway. Dad, can I build the toilet cubicle thing? Oh, I needed the uh, the toilet, the I toilet stickers. I need to finish that. That's all I wanted from the set. And she gave me a good price too. Oh. Not that she said, mentioned me on YouTube and you get it. No, no, no. <laughs> Spark idea, bang. <laughs> Cherie commission, no. That's funny. Okay, I got a I got a question that I can put to you guys if you're if you're interested in sharing your thoughts. Mm. I'm building the. Um, <coughs> what are you building? Sorry. Building the Avengers Infinity War thing. Ah, yeah, cool. Yeah, what were you saying, Dan? All right, so this is more for the streamers. Sorry, viewers, but more for the streamers. Uh, so I'm going to a convention this weekend. It's a it's our three day con, uh, basically the same as Brickvention. Uh, I decided that between the bricks is going to offer up an award. Uh, I have not decided on how to offer up or what criteria. So if you have any ideas for criteria for something totally out of the blue that nobody is really aware of, I'd be keen on your thoughts. <clears throat> so the the show awards will be taken care of. So they'll have a best in show, a exhibitor's choice, and three commendations, which can be given to anyone. Sorry. Three commendations, yes. Three commendations. So, um, and then I'll have my award, which I'll get to decide on. Um, can take people with me to help choose, and I'm looking at taking people from the community that don't necessarily get to be, get involved at that uh, judging level. So maybe people from the shop or people that do other stuff like that. Mm. So any ideas on, on how you think it could be awarded from a, from a community point of view, from a streamer's point of view, that would be pretty, pretty cool. Sorry mm. to put you on the spot. An award from a streamer's point of view. Well, from, from a community, from an online community's point of view, more than anything, I suppose. Probably could have thought it through a little bit better. Yes. Well, maybe maybe you could you could have, like, a, a people's choice, but, like, from your viewers. Mm. Sorry, technical difficulty. All back. Didn't even realise you were gone. Ah, oh, good. What was the question, Dan? You asked after advice or feedback or something? Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> no. Yeah, no. So I'm going to a con this weekend and I've create, uh, built a trophy from my community from Between the Bricks. And I don't know how or I have no real ideas in mind at the moment on how to decide how to give it away. Like, you know, best in show will be taken care of. Exhibitor's choice uh, and three commendations. So essentially, you know, you're looking at your five models that'll all get thing. And I don't know if I want to just go with what I think is the best, or you know, I don't know. Guys, got any ideas? Anything out of left field that I haven't thought of? I thought I am um, like a, a most improved type board. Yeah, except well, I work well. I probably would not. You weren't there last year to see what 
Well, I was because I organized last year's one. Mm. I got an idea. Maybe um, you look at the, the top five that you think of and ask some of your uh, friends um, what they think, maybe, and have an international flavor. Try and get uh, from all over the world if you can. Maybe some yeah. feedback. Okay. Yeah, I wonder what about, yeah, that's a good idea, actually. What about if I took photos of a bunch and then just put them up on up on Facebook somewhere for an open vote throughout the day on the Friday? Mm. So, you, yeah, you, you're getting that people's choice, but via the, um, the platform. Yeah. Might, things might look more appealing um via photo than they do in person so might be more detail that people actually pick up as opposed to moving parts and whatnot so yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, this is the trophy that i built oh that's cute oh that's very cute that's cool <laughs> 90 degree i want a trophy uh, thing and so it's built this similar to what I do on my um, this is what I do on my stream for my subscribers uh, I'm not going to get used to looking at painted fingernails but this is the trophy <laughs> and as a wee engraved uh, minifig on top and there is uh, these are one by eights in here so they'll be engraved as well so they'll have something to add to their brick badge as well as have the, the trophy <clears throat> And it's something that I'd like to do at all the shows that, that I go to, if possible, you know, as part of, uh, as part of I guess, the on, my online community's um, contribution to physical shows. That's a good idea. So, actually, I'm liking your idea, Steve. Get some photos and pop them up online for the community to decide. That's good. That's exactly how it should be done. Yeah, with, with MSELF, we have like a – a 30 minute challenge sort of thing. Usually it's just for bragging rights. You get a photo with the trophy. Um, and yeah, Justin usually goes with um, uh, send photos of the app of the uh, entries. And then, um, yeah, I guess judge will decide, but opening it up to a, to a, a wider audience would be really cool. Mm. That way you can get feedback and maybe uh, when presenting it, you could, you could look at some of the feedback and see if it's um, something you might've missed even not that you will, but, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll work on that. I'll see how it works for time wise. It'll literally be just Friday. Although, yeah, no, it would be. It'll be just on Friday. So that have, if I could get that done early ish in the morning, they'd have all day Friday to vote. It's a shame uh, Facebook's. Polling system is bro so broken. Well, I lost the instructions for my set, so I'm using my iPad to build it. <clears throat> That's a good idea, Harry. I think we've lost free to um, Snapchat. Playing with the filters. It's very much different. That's hilarious. And it was the stickers, too. Yep, you lost me. <clears throat> oh, God. It doesn't like two faces in the scene. That looks so weird. <laughs> it's because like you, you have a beard. It's a bearded lady. Let's, let's try that again. Hang on. You better get it in the right spot. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Makes and it even bigger. Okay, chin down. Chin down. No, it's not taking your beard away. Your beard is too strong for this. <laughs> Maybe you need to try it. Building. Oh, I'm a time limit, huh? Oh, yeah, good point. Beard power for the win. Yep. Yeah, his beard is so beardy, it won't, like, unbeard his beard. 
Um, to uh, answer Mickey's question from earlier, anyone go to the Morayfield show in Queensland? No. <laughs> the summer was contemplating it. They had sold out of tickets, which is great for the organisers, but sucky for anyone who's a last-minute planner. Did you have any Do we have any brick separators, he asks. There's like 10 within reach. Yeah. They keep growing. Oh, yeah, there's a bucket of them. I have three just sitting on the table in front of me right now. I don't know if you can see that container. Oh, just underneath the, the under, near the TV. Uh, you're all the brick separators. What's with all the bloody sound? I'm gonna hurry up. Oh, sound effects. You can't turn the sound effects off. That's stupid. I gotta hurry. This thing's about to run out of charge. Let's do bag five. I need a single bag for this one. Ooh, what does it do if you're a man and it puts a man filter on you? Nothing. Oh, it gives you slightly bushier. Nice look. Square rectangle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Nearly done. This is hours of entertainment. Yeah. This is say. this is the good quality can entertainment that you signed up for. I'm a pretty princess. The heck is that? Oh god, I'm a baby. <clears throat> mm, it's supposed to. Like a little grapple or something. Yeah, we've definitely lost three to um Snapchat. No, that's not where I went. Turn it around, find a face. Oh my lord. Some of these have like noises. Noises. What have I started? I don't know. You've, you've created a monster. It's been a long time since I looked at Snapchat. Let's just leave it at that. Well, who wants to hear a story about Snapchat? Nobody. <laughs> I think that's a yes. So is that my friend's Brody's house? Uh-oh. Uh, you might not be allowed to mention oh. names. Well, I was at his house, and <laughs> I went to, um, we went in his room, and after, uh -oh. we, after we stopped playing Xbox, we went to go on his iPad, and we made a Snapchat, and trust me, it was freaky as hell. Oh my god, I'm a hot dog. Never gonna remember it. The language my child uses. I said freaky. Yeah. That actually sounded pretty tame. Um. Yeah. Oh my it's been, god. It's been told. <laughs> I look like a brat stole now. Mm. Hey, I have nice hair though. <laughs> okay. oh. Hours of entertainment, yes. <clears throat> oh. I still don't understand the social media. Let's just try with a friend. <laughs> God. He's like, I don't understand. Alec, you're so pretty. I'm gonna build Lego and not play with Snapchat. Well, well, blame Dan. It's all Dan's fault. <laughs> Martin M says we have brick separators on key rings in pretty much in every room. Yeah. 
You name a place, and there's a brick separator. We got another one down there. We have a whole container of them somewhere. Yeah, somewhere. Dad, you should have kept that brick separated towel. There's three within hands reach. Yeah, I've got three just here. I've got one in front of me. I got one. Make that four. <laughs> Hours of entertainment. This is. Oh my god. My cat. So, so uh, Comic Con in Melbourne is going to have uh, a Lego exhibition. Cool. They're, they're giving us a. Uh, compound, I think it's about five or six tables to play with. Nice. So it should be good. Yeah, I want to go to a Comic-Con one year. Maybe. Yeah, they are used in it, but it makes it hard to use. Okay, I'm I'm no longer looking at Snapchat. Sorry. <laughs> Little dance fault. He's a bad influence. It's my or daughter. Depending depending on your perspective. God, I thought we'd lost you there for a minute, Sheree. I thought we we're gonna have to run the blooming stream without you. <laughs> Starting to feel like that. Mm. <coughs> Hours of entertainment, yes. Yeah, where was I before I got sidetracked? It's all I, don't know. I have no idea. Yeah. What I want to know is is what why why does the 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 male um, version of the fate uh, gender swap thing just give me a five o'clock shadow? I couldn't. You're not beard worthy. I couldn't see any difference. <laughs> Although, although the, the, the female one on me was like, oh, wow, that's pretty. <laughs> I'm done. All right, you ready for bed? No. Oh, you pong. Go have a shower. <laughs> you stink. Go have a shower. You do. You stink. Look, look for anyone that doesn't believe that I, I don't look pretty, I'll look at this. Um. Okay. You look younger. I'm a pretty princess. Mason, around this way. If you want to come in, I can see from here. Okay. You don't want to say hello? Hello. 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 That's a five year old. That's Mason. It's like kids' hour, isn't it? Yeah, I know. Look at the camera. Wait, that is, that is on the internet. So, is hi. It, you can watch this later. YouTube. Hello, Later. you're on YouTube. This is this is the the Legoland guy. Oh, famous! Yeah, you got a celebrity here. I see. You want to see yourself? Yeah. You can see yourself you're, there. You're as big a celebrity as Billsy. No, Hello. bigger. Wow. Bigger. Yeah. Yeah, bigger and littler. Because because uh, Miller and Jordan they wanted a photo with him. Wink, wink. <laughs> they, yeah. I they recognized him, but I played up on that. That's cute. All right, are you ready for bed now? Mm. It's time for bed. No, no. Goodness uh, gracious, it's nearly my 15 year old's bedtime. To you guys. Stop. <laughs> Streamception. Mason, look, you're on YouTube. Did you see? You can watch on your 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 iPad later, okay? All right. I might I'll go and put him to bed, and I'll I'll yeah, be back. Yeah, that's no, cool. Don't leave. I'll be here. I'll see you. <laughs> no, no, don't do it. Don't. <laughs> okay, stay here. Don't 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 be. Don't. Dad have... goes. Dad goes. I don't trust you, but by yourself. Please. No, I do have a rule. 
Harry, you can talk while I'm gone, but no, no talk. worries no, about yeah. what happened no, to sleepovers, all right? I promise. Undo it. No, you Undo don't. It. No, you're Batman. Okay. You have to talk Batman. in a bat. You have to talk like this, Harry. <laughs> I don't <laughs> shave. You don't have a beard. <laughs> That's funny. Martin M says, Perth doesn't have Comic Con no more. Only Supernova. Yeah, I saw that. That sucks. Are we there yet? Mason, get out! One last goodbye for Mason. Bye. Say bye, Mason. Bye. Oh, bye, Mason. Come on, Mason. I don't want it. Mum's having a play. Did you go on the camera? Yeah. I... You need to go to bed, too. I made him wave. Say goodbye. Say, good, say goodnight to the guys. What? Quick, say goodnight. Night. Properly. Come on. Good night. Looking more like a car. Mm. Much more like a car now. Lots of <laughs> greedy bits. Hey, I, I had a thought, Dan. You could have an award for nicest part use. As in, like a like a poop part use, part out of other part. Just yeah, yeah. Just you know, a nice usage of something obscure. Mm-hmm. But like, you know, part parts used for you know things other than their obvious use. Mm -hmm. Stormtrooper for a, for a, a toilet bowl that. sort of thing. Stormtrooper for a toilet bowl. The the helmet. Um, I don't think they do Lego exclusives at Comic Cons in Australia. That seems to be an American thing. But I would be happy to be wrong. I think they only seem to do it at the two really big ones. Mm. <clears throat> I think it's only um, San Diego and the New York Toy Fair that they seem to do exclusives at. Mm. I could be wrong. No, I'm pretty sure you're right. Everyone went quiet. Sound check, testing, okay. testing. That's the sound of concentration. <clears throat> I was just sitting here contemplating my life's choices as I was looking at my fingernails with the dents and the newly painted bits. Oh. Thinking, oh, I'm going to have to touch them up tomorrow. <laughs> How long do you have to keep them for? I have to keep them like this until the end of the convention this weekend. That's three full days with over 100 exhibitors from all over the country. Not to mention the five or six thousand visitors that are likely to turn up. And he's got to pick Billsy up. We'll often look like that too. Yeah, and Billsy will be there. And, oh, I'll have, yeah. and I'll have to stand up the front and talk when I'm giving out my award and shake somebody's hand and have photos. To, uh, it's just... Nah, that's great. You know what? I'm going to own it. I'm just going to rock in there and I'm going to own it. Strats. <laughs> They're probably yeah. fun. A lot of people won't even um, notice. Okay. Most people know me. Most people know me well enough that I'll do stupid things. Dan, Dan does stupid things. I know, right? <gasps> I'm shocked. 
Are you? Are you really? Oh, I'm well. so shocked. I'm sorry to have oh, shocked you. My core. I think this is the point where I, I put up a sarcasm sign. Hashtag sarcasm, yes. <laughs> <laughs> no? Oh, I would have never have got that from the tone of your voice. <laughs> no, no, you wouldn't. Can I join Hashtag the Hashtag shocked. Can I join <laughs> the Me Too movement on that one? Oh, dear. Dear, dear. I'm looking forward to it, though. I'm actually really looking forward to this con. There's like, so many people coming from all over the country. It's going to be good. Oh, it's cool. So which show is it? Was it called? It's called BrickCon NZ. BrickCon NZ. Yeah. We had to add the NZ because we literally ripped off BrickCon from Seattle. <laughs> if anything's worth flogging, flog it. It's a good name, you know. It's a convention. So what else are you going to call it? Could have called it anything, but... Brick no con. <laughs> yeah. Brick show, NZ. Hmm. Yeah, that, that, that's flogging the name from Sydney and God knows where else that all use the same name. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? When you're, you're not allowed to use the L word in, in the title of a show, you, you're kind of stuck with the word brick, aren't you? There's, there's got to be brick in there somewhere or rather. Well, brick is synonymous with the L-E-G-O. Exactly. Exactly. It's no oh. point calling it the uh, the Playmobil show. Speaking of Playmobil, I saw that there's going to be a Playmobil movie. Really? For yes. serious. It was on event cinemas, and I know it's not an April Fool's joke because we're no longer in April. Really? Is it like live action? Uh, like, um, it's a cartoon for realsies. Cartoon, but mm -hmm. of Playmobil got... figures. That's weird. Mm -hmm. they got a Playmobil characters. movie. Have wow. they got licensed characters? It's like, um, yeah. Could you not come up with a with a um more uh, unique name or an original idea? <laughs> Hmm. Well, I was. Now we're getting off topic from Lego, but is Playmobil still re Is it still a real popular thing? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, put, getting us back on the Lego topic. Nikki Three CS says, "Call it NZ Studs." <laughs> NZ Studs. Stud on. Could call it StudCon. That might have some other form of connotation, though. But... <laughs> About Billsy yeah, Con. Up a lot of dis a lot of disappointed ticket buyers. <laughs> <laughs> but think of the sellout, though. Oh yeah. Think of the um, payout and um, having to give them their money back. You, yeah, imagine the complaints. Hey, you said this was StudCon, and then I walked yeah. past. There go studs. Oh, that'd be funny. I'd pay to go to that. I'd pay to stay home. Freaking Dales. <laughs> oh, dear. Is he there or is he just being really, really quiet? Hello? He's, he's being a statue. He's very hey, me. I've only I'm spoken about half. Oh, I was going to say, I've only spoken half a dozen times. Hello? Hello? Not there? Can't hear you, Steve. I'll jump out and come back. He's muted himself. You muted yourself. Oh, bye then. Bye, Steve. Bye. Bye, Steve. Bye, Steve. You Maybe. scared him off. Maybe he's just going to go through the revolving door. Yeah, probably just going to go through the revolving door. Maybe he's going to go through the revolving door. <laughs> there he is. Hello? Hello. Oh, hey. oh, I don't know. I, I was talking and I'm like testing one, two, three, and then... Like, why is nobody acknowledging my presence? Yeah. So what was I saying? Um, nothing interesting. All good. Carry on. <laughs> 
I was going to say, nice shirt, Steve. And the boobs. Well, I was going to say, don't get them too close, man. You'll poke <laughs> someone's eye out. <laughs> yeah. It is pretty cold, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, the gym work's not happening. So. <laughs> That's the one. I skip forward, never do the figures till afterwards. And you have to work out what accessory goes where. Yeah, this is um, Bricolet from 2018. Last year. I know because I have one just like it. Oh, yeah, because you displayed. That's right. Yes. I haven't got my uh, 2019 one yet. Someone else is holding on to that in the goodies bag. So hopefully I get that soon. Oh, is it, is it being um, the word for it? Held hostage. Held hostage. Possibly, but that's all right. <laughs> It'll what get there. Color, what colour was this year? I don't know. Um, trying to think. Was, was it, it blue, yellow? blue, maybe? I don't know. Blue? I know I've got a white one from the year before, from 2017. Um, someone in chat will know, won't they? Uh, maybe, maybe not. One of those things where you pay attention at the time and then you just forget. you got a drawer full of these things now. It's cool. <laughs> Don't wear them often, but I think we needed to wash some clothes. Oh, oh. well, you, you can wear you can wear them whenever you stream. Well, the good thing is they don't have exhibitor on the back, so you don't have to worry about you know the uh, the stress of um, walking down the street and someone says, "Oh, what are you exhibiting?" <laughs> the prevention. I must admit, I've never been asked that. I've worn my my orange shirt from Brickvention very many times, haven't I? Yeah, it's been a while since it's worn it. Because I wore it out. Place a piece here, place a piece here. Place a piece, place a piece, place a piece, piece. It's looking more like a car. Oh, don't do that. This is easy to retrieve, relatively. Feeling more and more solid all the time. Boom, 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 boom. If I was to build that set, I, I would be singing Mustang Sally. I just couldn't help myself. <clears throat> Mustang Sally. I have to admit, that is a good song. Doesn't help that my parents were um, obsessed with the commitments. Yeah, my mum was into country and western, so... Anytime we did those long trips, it was uh, mum's tape in the old tape deck of the car. And, oh, I hate that stuff. <coughs> Hated it. The, um, yeah, and if you ever run out of batteries, because we had the Walkman at the time, yeah, killer. You'd have to listen to our music. <gasps> oh, it was garbage. I'll be back in 2 6. Well, in a minute. Not even cool stuff like Johnny Cash. It was just. People yodeling sort of stuff. That's what it sounded like. Yodel, yodel, yodel. Yeah. Apologies to those country and Western fans out there that are into that stuff. And my parents are like Black Sorrows and Van Morrison and all those guys. There's nothing wrong with any of that. I would have traded for that. That's all I had as a child. It's a good upbringing, I think. Yeah, that was, that was decent Aussie music good. there. And my dad was really big into Australian rock. Yeah, 
Yeah, I did get uh, in the eighties. I did get uh, my brothers, uh, brother, older brothers were were, were uh, right up to date with the music. So Midnight Oil and Michael Jackson and um, Bruce Springsteen, um, all that stuff, all that cool stuff from the eighties. Um, yeah. Well, my parents were. Probably more like um, 60s and 70s. Yeah. That, that sort of genre. You know, so like Del Shannon and Johnny Farnham and all those guys. I think my dad was a bit into Pink Floyd as well. Led Zeppelin. It's good musical education there. He, he sort of stopped playing them when me and my brother were kids. I only know it because I saw these um, record collection. It's still the old, all the original LPs. My dad also liked um, Billy Thorpe as well. Trying to think of this song. Um, most people I know, is that the one? Think that I'm crazy? Is that the song? I the song, but... Most people I know think that I'm crazy. Yeah, that's the song. Yeah. Just can't picture it being sung by him, that's all. In my head, it's like Billy Thorpe and the Aztecs. Yeah. Does that sound right? Yeah, that's the name. That's definitely the name of the band. My dad got to see them at Redcliffe when he was growing up there. So I'm ditching the kids on Comic Con weekend off of a Saturday night. I get to go to the adult uh, adult night at Chadston. Cool. Uh, it could be fun, that one. Mm. <clears> there <throat> might be something we might have to do while we're down there. Is visit Chadston. Whoa. The, sh the shopping capital, Chadston. Yeah, no, it's... the Lego store. <laughs> I've heard it's a very, very large store. Oh, I place. only know of one store at Chadston, so... I was like, there's only one store at Chadston that I would care about. Oh, yeah. The, the, the boss, the wife, she likes to go to Meyer and whatever else is down there. I don't know. I usually just, yep, I'll be over here and I'll take the kids with me because until they get absolutely bored, and they do, uh, it's let's fill a brick, pick a brick cup. Um, <laughs> let's talk to the other AFOLs. Yeah, apparently, I talk too much. <laughs> really? I never would have guessed. No. Kids with no respect telling their dad off for what he's doing wrong. He did something wrong. Yeah. Shouldn't talk while building. No. You should That's not. It's better than talking to yourself by building. What's Dad, wrong with you... talking to yourself? Whilst building. Oh, whilst building. Yeah. yeah. Dan, you still there? Yeah. I oh, was just checking. Man, I talk to myself while building all the time. Yeah, it's called Twitch. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> but do you talk back? No, yeah. I don't. No, I don't have conversations with myself. I have conversations with myself. It's hilarious. Well, actually, it's more like a proxy it's... conversation with the man who's not talking. Hang on, I thought it, so. It's hilarious for the two of you, as in yourself and you. Yeah, of course. <laughs> oh, yeah. don't break it. It's, it's only crazy when you do talk back to yourself, right? 
the, the second sign of madness. Oh. Answering yourself. What's I think it's crazy if you admit yourself. it to others. Uh, so when you start answering yourself, then you might have some serious problems. I like how you say you might have. Sometimes talking to yourself might keep you sane. That is true. It's all about the circumstances. Okay. What's that? Uh, mm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The top part of the door. The top part of the door. As opposed to the bottom part of the door. Well, the bottom part of the door is already built. On the door. Myth Dusters asks, is that a 1989 Batmobile in a case behind Stephen? 100% it is. We'll do the turnaround. Cool, the Tim Burton Batmobile. Yeah, I bought the the instructions off uh, a, a website. It's the first time I've ever purchased instructions to build someone else's mock. It's it's awesome. It's phenomenal. Good. Cool. Oh, what else we got? Records. Brigades. I'm sad they're gone. No, they're, they're, coming back. they're not. They're coming back. They're coming back, as so I've heard. Awesome. Big in 2020. <sighs> Woohoo, Brickheads are coming back. I like Brickheads. So we still haven't built them all yet. No, we haven't. So we've got two there, one there. A couple more in the cupboard over there. Brickhead's never left. <laughs> yeah, you can play that. And sort of more just put the back seat this year. Mickey and Minnie are the only two that I didn't build yet of the ones that I've purchased. Yeah, I think we'll put uh, Warner and Crafty. Maybe a couple. I think it's mostly the seasonals that we haven't built. Oh, actually, I do have a uh, an Easter bunny as well. Sorry. Yeah, I've that would have been last year's Easter bunny. Yeah. I pulled apart the um, uh, the Easter egg chase thing set today. I was bored. At, I thought. I'm going to be bored at swimming, so there's yeah, some cool parts in it. A grey egg. Have you guys seen it? I'll grab it. Hang on a sec. <clears throat> no, I don't think we've got that one. This boring one. <laughs> Guys, ever skip ahead when you know, like you've got wheels to put on the um, on the the, the build because you know how to do it. It's like I find myself doing it all the time, skipping ahead and just building, and then having to move like five pages. Uh, is that something you guys do, or do you build, change the page, and then build again? No, I do that. What the heck? I'm glad I'm not the only one. I skip ahead a lot only to find out sometimes I've made a mistake and I have to go back and correct it. Oh, yeah, do that too. Absolutely. Well, sometimes I'll sort of look, just look at the last picture out of the 
two pages and build off that. And sometimes that gets you in trouble too. Maybe. Oh. Hey, this really cool um, table thing that Kelly found for me. Let's switch it to him. It's really cool. Just put like a, a Batman thing into it, but comes off. So you have like a, a tray. That's oh. so cool. That is so, cool. I like to take <laughs> I like to take that one to um, exhibitions or events or whatever. Just something you can easily um, put away if you're not building. Mm. But yeah, it's good height too. Yeah, a little uh, tray table thing. One of those local buy swap sell finds. Nice. And now for the dunny. Getting close. Very close. I've only got physically two more bags to go. And that's done. Didn't skip ahead with the wheels, did you? No. <laughs> I don't want it rolling around. No, that's a fair point. Besides, the wheels. You're forced to do the wheels last because they're in the last bag. They don't come loose in the um in this one. A lot of the creator vehicles are like that, I think. You don't get the wheels until the last bag. Man, it is hosing down outside here. Hosing? That's really, 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 really raining heavy. It's the heaviest rain we've had in ages, actually. Beautiful sunshine. It's coming in sideways because I can hear it hitting the outside wall as well, which has an overhang. You keep the rain on that side of the ditch for a while. Sick of the rain at the moment. It was a bit of a Maybe. Wow, Douglas is in the chat. He goes, who is this beard-free dark side bricks? <laughs> maybe, his, maybe his name should be called Rustling Bricks. Rustling Bricks. Uh, Mickey3CS asks, do we have the more, I'm assuming you mean brickheads? We don't have the common corn ones and we don't have Benny or um, um, uh, the, um, Thingy Mayhem. Um, no. Captain Mayhem? Mayhem Sweet or... Mayhem, that's it. Yeah, there is a rank there. Okay, obviously I've missed a few decks. What steps did, did you miss? Is that the only ones you don't have? Just the comic, comic, <laughs> and those two exclusives? Pretty much. Yeah. 
Pretty much. All the rest. All the rest. We, we don't have any any of the Comic Con ones, and we don't have those two exclusives. We have every other one. Yes. Making noise, making noise, making noise. Hello, look at this one. Ah. You're so mean. It's the only Comic Con thing that I own. Yeah, I draw the line at Comic Con exclusives. I refuse to pay a markup. Yeah, I, I paid one hundred dollars for that. That's not bad, actually. No, that was really good. Even at the time, it was really good. I had the option to buy more, and I thought, no, I'll just get the one. And I'm like, damn it, why did not I buy more? And not of the same one. It would have been the uh, Marvel and stuff, but Batman Joker. Because yeah, it's, it's like the it's the Jack Nicholson Joker too. So, oh, well, to yeah. me, it is. Haven't opened it. Probably won't. <laughs> Get to a point where um, if you haven't opened something by a certain time, you you think it's probably never going to get opened. Bags. Do you have the um the Hong Kong one? No. I didn't. No, I didn't yeah, get a hand nothing on that that's one. an exclusive. It was such a good, it was a really good looking brickhead too. Um, there's some really nice custom brickheads out there. There's a guy who's done all the Lord of the Rings ones, uh, the, the Fellowship. Um, oh, I'd love to get hold of those instructions and build those because they look really good. Yeah, one of the guys on one of the guys in Alog is obsessed with making custom brickheads and he's done a, he does a really good job on them too. So. stickers yet but this one was cool it's an older one anyway you've probably seen it before oh, i think yeah i think so but toilet on the top yeah, i think your brother got a couple of those recently mm. yeah, this one i remember seeing it and i'm like eh, i like the idea just the idea of a, a, a random toilet sort of in a location there but if i had known the stickers were so cool and hard to find. I probably would have bought it back in the day.
everyone's gone all quiet again. Yeah, of course. Ugh. <coughs> okay, what bag are we on from here? The last one. Just said that like three times. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Oh wow, I'm so rude. <clears throat> yeah, not paying attention to your own husband. I'm being distracted. Really? Yes. Never have guessed that, honey. She's not back on Snapchat, is she? No. No, no, I'm being distracted by Facebook Messenger. An admin job is never done. And considering I'm admin in multiple places, that's a pretty high probability. So I took the uh, the figure out so I could put it in my display cabinet, but I haven't built the set yet. Oh, it's Lucky a tiny. You. Yeah, so that's uh. Yeah. But Avengers Tower. I'm gonna yeah, play with that one. one. It was available on our shop at home for all of like three minutes or something. Yeah. I got a I got a two shop at home. <laughs> but if I'd have known it was gonna be as hard as it was, I probably would have just gone down to Chatty and got one. They had them for for days. Oh. Hundred dollars with purchase. Sorry, hundred dollars. Hundred dollars with purchase. It's free with purchase. <laughs> That's why I didn't go. It's going to cost me hundred dollars. No. Minimum. Yeah. yeah, if I had a, had have known, I would have spent that hundred dollars down at um, Chadston and pick it up on the spot too. Mm. I don't think they. I don't think Greenwald even got it. If it did, it didn't last very long. First time I've seen this when I um, created a car as a rear vision mirror. Complete with car in the. Yeah, it helps if you click on things. Yeah. yeah got a little one by two sticker. Right in your rear vision mirror because you're smoking them in a drag race. Nice. <laughs> First time I've seen a rear vision mirror. One of these parts. Wheezy burger. Some things I could put on for uh, some B champion sets. A rear vision, a rear vision mirror. Yeah. And not look out of place at all. Be small enough for it though. <clears throat> mm. Stripey. Yeah. And and we have a Quinjet. Nope. Oh. Blaster. It's a tiny. You the, can the, eat it, it's so tiny. The blaster wings. Ah, oh, so little. It's adorable. <laughs> so, oh, baby. <laughs> it's a little baby Quinjet. Yeah, until it makes noise. Then it's wow. getting...
some uh, turquoise parts. They're definitely waking their way into more and more sets. Hmm. Oh, this looks cool. Turquoise or teal? Well, it could be teal. I just I thought it was turquoise, but where's uh, where's Bailey when you need him? <laughs> yeah. Nice color palette. Mm, hang on. Color colors. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's teal. Okay. Turquoise might be a part that I don't produce anymore. Those are parts that are in the party bus according to Douglas. I've built the party bus. Yeah. Definitely teal. The uh, the part I was after the most of the party bus was the uh, the pink afro hairpiece. Oh yeah. It's, a, it's bigger than the other afro hair pieces, I didn't realise. Yes, it is. Scored that one from Jason. It was like... That's because the other Afro hair pieces are clown hair pieces. Hmm. Just tighter and closer to the head. Or you could do like that meme does all the time and... No, those raspberry. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, unfortunately, raspberries eventually go off. Yeah. Well, they'll probably actually just melt onto the... No, they go off. <laughs> Diggler says, I passed it a second party bus. Must be nice. <clears throat> Well, it looks like we're getting together a good selection of people coming to one um, convention, Stephen. Have they, they done the application yet? Oh, yeah. And pity that um, Michael hadn't actually put in, like, the name of Lugs on the application oh, okay. form. And now, now I have to go and find out who's filled it in sooner. So, so that I can give him names that this person is q -lug, this person is q -lug. I was just thinking, I, I need more work to do. Uh, Diggler says that Party Bus is $89 clearance on Kmart. I do not need another Party Bus. No, I do not want more. You're a bad influence. He's a bad influence. I say no. Uh, Jason says, I did yeah. mention q -Lug in the description box. Good job. Yeah, I think it would have made a lot a lot more sense to have just, you know, listed off all the R-Lugs. Regardless of whether you think they're coming. Well, at least the ones in Australia. Just a, another drop box to add in. It shouldn't <laughs> be too hard. Uh, hello, Charm City Brick. Long time no see. 
Ugh, I need sparkly vampires. Ugh, I'm trying not to want sparkly vampires. You're a bad influence, Douglas. <laughs> bad influence. I'm putting my foot down and saying no. <laughs> I'm not allowed a sparkly teenage vampire. Oh, are you jealous? <laughs> that was worth it just for the face. Oh, Chauncey says he took a promotion and now has no life. Oh, how sad. But what does that say? Think of the money. More things in life are more important than money. I mean, money, you know, a certain amount is good. <clears throat> Just thinking, uh, Mr. Burns, how else can you afford that gorilla vest? <laughs> the weird things that go through my mind. See your vest, see your vest, made a real gorilla chest. See my vest. Yeah, I know. And um, these gophers, former loafers. Yeah. No, these loafers, former gophers. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't singing it like I was Monty Burns. I was singing it to Monty Burns. Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh. You've got sirens going off in the background. Is he there underwear? Someone's in trouble. I can't remember the rest of it. Quick hide. Underwear. Have you guys seen a list of what's coming on June first? Possibly, I don't know. I'm guessing maybe not. We did see stuff at Toy Fair. Of course you did. This actually makes the basis for a good trophy, Dan. <laughs> good trophy base. Hmm. Just seeing like a, a dude bowling or something. <laughs> or Australian built... cricketer bowling underarm, maybe. <laughs> I built my trophy yesterday in bricks. And then today I built it in uh, Studio or Stud.io, whatever you want to call it. It's the first time I've ever used Stud.io. I'm terrible with that stuff. I I would get too confused too quickly. So I play with uh play with the the stuff in front of me and create something. And yeah, I can't uh, do it. Just, I'm too old. I can just to try something new. I'm the same, and it did take me a wee while to sort of. And, you know, let's face it, it's pretty easy because it's just a bunch of bricks stacked. Um, and, it, yeah, it did take me a wee while to sort it out. But um, it was good because I could build it with optimal parts, not just the parts that I had in my drawers. Yep. Uh, and then it gives me a uh, an accurate parts count for when I want to uh, buy some more or something. Have normal version of the Mustang. 
spot. It's not finished yet, though. Yeah, this, well, this is what it's up to in the construction. Okay, you have yeah. lots of pieces left, though. Yeah, there's, there's adaptations that you... Do. Oh, okay. <laughs> so they actually get these, they're taken off. Spare parts box. <clears throat> well, you put a front spoiler on it, and you put a sort of more race exhaust on it, you take this out, and you put a big blower in there. Okay. Well, can we be one? Spoiler that goes on the back of it here as well. So that's what I'm about to build, but that's Mustang in normal mode. Normal mode engaged. You better slow that Mustang down. <laughs> Mustang Sally. Oh, it looks really cool. That does look good. Definitely uh, better than a party bus. Better than a party bus? No, 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 no. <laughs> you can make party calls on the party bus. Mm. And Steven's like, I don't know you. Ignoring me. He's pretending he didn't hear me. He can't pretend. <laughs> he was trying. Doesn't work. So, change of time. Have you built something for brick fencing? Or where are you at with that? Are you asking me or him? Uh, the people on this screen. The people on the screen. That's everybody. Well, well Philip says that he can't do brick fencing. The one I'm looking at has you guys. Are you looking at us? Uh, well, he's already got a display. He's got Minecraft. Cool. So we might might make some alterations to it to yeah, you know, spice it up for brick mansion. Um, at the moment, all I have is Micropolis, and I was told in no uncertain terms that Peebles never wants to see Micropolis ever again. <laughs> he might not, but the, the people coming in to see the show might. I know. So... Well, if they're going to have a, um, a collaborative, I'll happily join that. But I have something else up in my sleeve that I am trying to um, get some forward momentum on, but I don't want to say anything about oh. publicly yet. Oh, no, absolutely. No. I, I've, I'm yet to decide what I want to build or what I, uh, what I could potentially build. And if I have enough parts at this stage, because I still have a, a roller coaster to destroy at some point soon. Um, yeah, so I'm not, I haven't even put in a thought of putting in an application yet. Um, I think we've got till the 1st of August on that anyway. But mm. um, I, 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 would, I would like to um, do something dinosaurs. My problem is, is that. If I was to build something other than Micropolis, I would have to also build a travel box to put it in. Because, mm. of course, we're tracking all our stuff down. Mm. So, um, yeah, from what I can tell, there's going to be some exciting displays coming from Queensland. Cool. Um, we even got one bloke from Longreach who's... Um, Put in his. Uh, <laughs> Jason says I got to do disco dinosaurs. Oh, dinos after dark. That'd be funny. Um, yeah, Jason's got some very very cool um custom brickheads. So um, it'd be interesting to see some brickheads at Brickvention. Like he, now, he you was, said, you said brickheads, right? Custom brickheads, yeah. That's okay. It's all right. Yeah, cool ones. That's all right. Not, 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 not just a collection, no. No, that's all right. I, I, I misheard the word brick. No. You get them everywhere. What did you think I said? <laughs> I wasn't sure. He goes, I'm not going to repeat it because it wasn't nice. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, no. That's You're Aussie funny. Brick Chick after dark. You're funny, Stephen. <laughs> I'm not funny. <laughs> naughty is the word. Naughty, not funny. Yeah, funny. Behave, Steve. What? Behave, Stephen. 
Behave. Oh. Oh, behave. Oh. But yes, I, I would like to do something dinosaurs, but I don't know what. And it'd have to be a lot smaller than what I'd like to take. Maybe you could do the, the baby from the, uh, do you remember the old dinosaur show, the Not the Mama, Not the Mama? Oh, God, that would require me to actually, like, create something out of bricks. No, thank you. Well, that's an idea. It's an idea, but. It's the concept. I have I have lots of like molded dinosaurs. Yeah. Why would I want a brick filled one? Uh, challenge? No, no, no. I, I would have to sink money into bricks that I don't have. Maybe another day. <laughs> you want me to actually get to Melvin, Stephen? Yeah, no, that's true. We do want that. That that requires me using things that I already have. Ooh, that's interesting. Yeah, it's the blower. It's a thingy. <clears throat> Big power upgrade. It's a thingy. Cool. Um, I'll be back. I've just got to do some disciplining because the kids aren't going to bed. Oh, that's my fault for being exciting on a school night. I oh, know they're not listening to you. They're just kids on a school night. I don't, I don't want to go to bed. <laughs> No, but Daddy's doing things. Yeah, playing Flego. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and Mummy's putting kids to bed. Yeah, cool. All right, I'll be back. You, you promise? Know. Yeah, I'll show you the Batman instead. <laughs> With the voice, I'm Batman. I'm Batman. I can't do the voice. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. Lego always seems to require parts you don't have. No, Lego mocking requires parts that you don't have. Unless you like me and I just, you know, plan around what I already have because I is poor. It's quite rare when I, you know, buy parts to make something specifically. I think the last time I did that was when I did my Micropolis Airport. Parts. Yeah. Room, room. Race exhaust. More bits. Yeah. Bitty bit, 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 bit. They're all the big pile of parts is disappearing. Yeah, slowly does it. Oh, that was a dark blue. Such a nice color. Buddy, buddy, but, 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 but. So I like the idea of doing the um, Lego Masters apartment challenge as a collaborative, but that also would involve parts that I don't have, perhaps, very likely. Well, you probably need to buy all the parts to make the apartment shell, but you probably have the rest. Hmm. Not necessarily. You want things like windows and stuff. True. But they, that could be classified as the wind, it's a shell. Hmm. Huh. The Charm City, City says, or oh, take way more parts than you thought it would take. Yeah. Yeah, I think it'd be that. That's, that's kind of Micropolis too. Like by the time you make the base... Somebody can't tell the time. You're late. Try six. <laughs> it says 9.35 there, 9.36 here, 9.35 there, 9.35. Yes. 
It must be. How can that even be possible? Yeah. Yeah. Front lip to put on the front of the car. Oh. Ah. Splash. Vicious fish. Are the smallest parts do get expensive really fast, Charm City? The smaller the piece, the more you need of them. <laughs> Teenager is looking at me funny. He's overfeeding the fish. Say hey, hello, everybody. Mm. <laughs> A grunt of an approving teenager. Good night. Not not you, him. Good night, child. Don't forget to do the things you should do before bed. Oh, no. Don't drop the duck blue. Those are useful for something. Mm. What about a series of Stranger Things upside down sets? Typical Aussie scenes with dark down under version. That could be interesting. It would also involve pieces that I don't have in enough quantities. Do 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 do. So what's in the pile after the Ford? Um, we haven't gotten that far yet, Dan. <clears throat> we still have the bus. What the party bus? No, no the London bus. The London bus. We also have Assembly Square. We have. Garage. The garage. We have an assortment of other things that I can't rattle off the top of my head right now. The things that are behind us. <laughs> Diggler says, who's good at picking up bits with your toes? You are. Yes, I've had lots of practice at that. <laughs> sure beats having to go under the tail. <laughs> I come back for that. <laughs> Sorry, that was awkward. Oh, that's cute. The hair is so huge. Cool. That is a what, especially on a um, a mini figure head too, yeah. and with the short legs. So, what's that out of? Oh, right? the the party bus. That's the that party head. bus. One of the um the DJs, the hype hype girl. Has really big pink afro. <laughs> Jason says, I can find pieces easy with my bare feet. What, by standing on them in the dark? Ooh. Was that NOS or something? Yep. Ooh. Vroom, vroom. Let's have time to change it. And add some upgrades, huh? Else yeah. if you don't throw them on the floor. I didn't throw it, dropped it. Uh, I'll see if it thingy things. Some afros. <laughs> All the clowns. Is this just a collection or has it got a purpose? A bit of both. Um, yeah. Definitely a collection, okay. but... Um, like, you could tell us, but then you'd have to kill us? Oh, no, no. <laughs> uh, I'm not super secretive with everything, but... Um, no. <laughs> No, I'd like to do something with the, with the clowns, especially, you know, at, at a place like Brickvention where you just know people have a phobia. So, um, 
a little bit cruel, but you know. Cruel to be kind. Oh, you got cool Steve, cool fix Steve. Yeah, I think it's cool. That, I don't have a clown phobia. Was that? Oh no, he's dropping everything. Anyway, I think you were the klutz and not me. He's playing the gotta take things out to put things in. I'm getting there. God, it's like like watching a kid play with a toy. And we have race version. Vroom, vroom. It might be awkward to dry something like that. How do you see? <laughs> Around the sides. Is, it, is something like that street legal or not? No, it's got right. knots. I, I wouldn't know. Uh, in America, it is. Yeah. All oh, the the um the wing is it a wing or tail? That's sort of like a little tail. Mm. It looks nice. It, it looks. It actually finishes it off better. I think. Yeah, I think having this on it. Yeah. Kind of. I kind of like the the side exiting exhaust. Yeah, that's and the, cool. The front. It it does say to um, jack up the rear suspension, but I think it just makes it look odd. Oh, I think that's just because that that's how it would be if it had that that. I don't. It, I personally think it looks better level than having the. Depends on whether you want to be realistic or not. You want to be realistic, it should look like that because of the amount of um, force it lifts off, the, lifts the front of the car when yeah, it takes no off. They put wheelie bars on the back of it. Anyway, you're better off having yes. Depends how you drive. <laughs> <laughs> if you drive like a little granny, you can have it flat. <clears throat> Personally, I think it looks better level. You drive for the spotter. Oh, B Fab's dropped in. Hello, brother from another brick. Uh, maybe yeah. it's maybe it's on the angle so you can actually see over the blower. Possibly. Yeah, maybe. But yeah, this is definitely. He's like, like, definitely I'm stepped so up. glad I got this car. Lego have definitely stepped up on this one. Is oh, it, we're keeping you up. Are they stickers on the side for like just just above where the the um the window is at the back of it? Where looks like there's some um no. Nah, there's very um, few stickers in this at all. There's. It looks like there's there's something like a groove or something just like behind like the yeah that's the area. Is that's that a groove? A no, that's printed sticker. No, it's printed. Oh. This is all the stickers. Yep. I come. And most of them are license plates, so there's only like two, four, six, mm. eight yeah, yeah, yep. on this whole entire set. Yeah, you can sort yeah, of see cool. that there's a groove or something, but can't tell if it's... So that's a decal, is it? Oh, so no, it's that's, printed. Printed. That's, that's printed. printed. You're talking about yeah. the... Yeah. Yeah, that's printed. Cool, because I was looking, thinking, what elements could you get to make that shape? It doesn't look like it's doable, but yeah, it makes sense if it's a printed, so... Yeah, the printed part. And uh, unfortunately, I've, it seems to be the the second run of the Mustangs, the the side here, with the so printing bad. there. It's pretty level. Like it's not so even bad. um Bilza, who built his last week, said yeah, his almost lines up perfectly too. Mm, not so bad. There must Whereas be something to do with the second. Like... Yeah, some of them sort of go up, mm -hmm. boop, 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 really like. Jagged, dodgy paint job. Yeah, something happened in the the, the printing, printing part. Didn't and, like line up all, across yeah, all the but, tiles. Like it's still not a hundred percent perfect, but it's better than what we've seen. Yeah, this is some of the best I've seen. And yeah, but even Bilzer, who bought his about the same time as I bought this one, same. And it's a lot up. the the deep. The, yeah. the Diggler says, oh, well, have to buy another one. 
Because <laughs> what you could do is you could contact Lego and try and see if they would send you replacements of the tiles that are not straight. I think it might be cheaper for Douglas to actually purchase the uh, the company of Lego with the amount of Lego. <laughs> <laughs> No, but uh, what I'm saying is you could try and contact them and complain it because it is a printing error. Anyway, so we are finished. Oh, and I forgot to plug us in. So on that note, it's time to say goodnight because we are battery low on the laptop because some genies forgot to plug in the power. I want to say thank you to everyone who's joined us in the live chat tonight. You guys make it lively. And Tuesday nights is build night, so mm. we've got something built. Yeah, I'm very happy. Definitely he, he's very it. happy. Very, Thanks. very happy. I want to say thank you to the guys that have joined us on the panel, and thank you, Stephen. Thank you for having me. Better late than never. Apologies. <laughs> <laughs> I say thank you to Darkside Bricks. Well, at least I think it's Darkside Bricks. Yes, it's Darkside Bricks. Sounds like him. Sounds like him. And thank you to Dan, the man from New Zealand, aka okay, uh, Between the Bricks. Good night. And as always, uh, go check out Philip and Dan's uh, Twitch if you do Twitch. On that note, I want to say good night to everybody. I will see you on Friday. Night, Mason and Harry. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Uh -oh.